five. The search is underway tonight for this man, who Walpole police say should be considered armed and dangerous. Yeah, police say he attacked someone with a knife last night. WBZ's Bill Shields live in Walpole tonight, where the search continues even today. Bill? And Dave, that family member who was attacked is indeed someone closely related to this suspect. It all happened at this very well-kept, nice home in a great neighborhood on Common Street here in Walpole. And that suspect is still out there somewhere. It happened at the family home on Common Street in Walpole. According to one investigator, Ian Crowley had been drinking. And when a family member admonished him, they say Crowley went into a rage, grabbing a large carving knife, attacking and slashing his own family member. The act that was committed afterwards uh, is definitely concerning. And then now you have him leaving the house and you have him running into a neighborhood. Uh, where we didn't find a weapon at the scene, so we think that he still had a, a weapon on him. Police believe Crowley ran into the woods, and they say he's adept at living in a wooded setting, so he could be anywhere, which unnerves neighbors here, knowing Ian Crowley is out there armed with a large knife. I'd be nervous, you know, but I, that's not all there, and he's out there somewhere, and... There's kids and, and old people knife. and everything. He's got a knife, and it's very dangerous. Really, really dangerous. And we spoke with other neighbors around here. They say the same thing. They're very concerned about this because he, Ian Crowley, is known to be somewhat unstable, if you will. And he hasn't been here for a while, came back to live at home for a time. Now this. So people around here are very concerned. Reporting live from Walpole, I'm Bill Shields, WBC News.